I could have sworn like elixirs recovered your maximum HP as well, but I guess they don't. Hmm. Okay, doesn't matter. Right, uh... I should have really head back to the car. What was that treasure? We'll go grab that, we'll go heal quickly. And uh, then we'll jump in the car. Right, so the treasure's just round here, not too far away. Oh, nice here. Yeah. Made a right pig's ear of that, though. Did not expect them to be that tough. I mean, they were only level 11, weren't they? Damn. I'm going to have to be more careful. Where the fuck is it? Where is it? It's not actually in here. Where the pissing hell is it? Is it on top? It must be up top. Oh, there's our tent still up. We didn't put it down. Oh, well, it'll be quick and easy to rest up there then, I suppose. Well, this isn't the treasure, but I'll pick it up anyway. More iron shavings. They shave the day. Here we go. Better be worth it. Fencer's anklet. Ooh, new accessory. Let's give that to someone. Um, what does it actually do, though, first of all? Ah, increases defense. Well, I think... We'll give that to Iggy for now. Did I actually give it to him? Yes, I did. Right then. Uh, oh, actually, as well, we might as well just quickly check our outfits. I can't remember if I showed them off or just mentioned them last time, so... Um, you can take your jacket off, you get different stats depending on which one you equip. So more attack usually when you take off your jacket but less HP. And the casual stuff is pretty terrible, really. I mean, they look cool and all, I suppose, but I think I'll just keep with the defaults for now. Uh, Ignis, what have you got? I think it looks pretty smart there, pretty smart. Again, very cool, belt and braces. But stats-wise, I just prefer having a bit of HP at this point, anyway. Um, I might... Because Gladiolus has got so much health anyway, I'd rather have him with a bit more attack. So he's just going to have his little tank top on. And Noct, I don't... Um, don't really know what to do with you. Because you do have a bit more of a choice here. you got the Royal Raiment, which was um, an extra outfit I'd got. With the game, it's actually probably the best one stats-wise for us at the moment, I think. Yeah, it is. Slightly less attack than the uh, fatigues. Uh, right then, I think we'll... See, I just don't like running around in that, it just doesn't look right. You're out in the wilderness and you're wearing a freaking suit. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna take the jacket off for now, a bit more attack. Probably gonna regret that. Right then, so, let's go to the car. I fucked up the sprint thing again. Where is the car? There it is. Um, I think I was going to heal, but we, we should be okay. It's not that far, and I don't think there's going to be anything too scary that way. Uh, so, auto, please. Quest location. Thank you kindly. That's actually near another uh, haven. What's the forecast? Clear skies, with the temperature rising. Nice. Just got to keep an eye on that fuel gauge. It's a bit of a pain in the ass if you run out. Maybe Sid was right about your lack of dignity. You're one step above delivery, boy. The royal rank carries little weight outside the Crown City. Glad it's not weighing me down. I don't know. I think people should be definitely recognizing the prince, at least. I mean, I understand the rest of the guys. 
they wouldn't have been in the in the public spotlight as much, especially not Prompto, because he's just a, a a peasant. But still, Noctis. You know, it's it's pretty technologically advanced. They have TVs and shit, don't they? Do they have TVs? I don't know, actually. I know they have radios. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're nearly there now. Oh, I need to get comfy in this chair. It's just not quite oh, good for my back, I don't think. And if you hear my dog snoring at any point, it's because he's probably fallen asleep. He's led right you under sure my chair. We're in the right spot? According to the map. Let's scope it out. Who's up for a hike? Always. On a day like this. Uh, so we'll grab the elemental shite before we leave. Oh, there's a procurement point as well. Are you going to come up with a new recipe? Oh no, we've already got these. Definitely make some decent magic now. Got a decent stock of uh, elements. Not really max, actually. Uh, the lightning one's a bit... Oh, it's all the way over there. We'll come back for it. We'll probably end up resting at the campfire anyway. I mean, as you can see, our maximum HP is slowly regenerating anyway, so I might not need to. Grab whatever this shit is over here. More roots, probably. Oh no! Green peas! No new recipes with the peas, Ignis? Or have we already got those? I don't know. Alright, where is this thing? Oh, right, okay, it's changing location. We have to go across here. Onward. That's that's what I'm doing. This is a lot of effort for for a journalist. Oh, hello. This will make a fine paint. I'm I'm sure it will. Prismatic dust. Gold dust. Oh, M G. Oh crap. You're supposed to get near that thing. It's the big Fly bird. Down before you wake it up. This must be its nest. Either that or it's just laying down for a kip. He is fucking huge! That is some serious featherage over there, isn't it? Gotta be careful, gotta take it slow. Don't really want to wake him up. Although, I have never actually seen him wake up here. I don't know what happens if he does, if he just flies off, or if he fucking murders you. Easy now. Easy now. No need to... Uh, you've got some lovely, lovely feathers or hair or whatever that is. You're very pretty, but you're incredibly scary at the same time. Oh, fuck. Sneaky, sneaky, right. It's all... Oh, it just had to be right in its tail, didn't it? Are we going to get swatted off this cliff if we try and take this? I reckon we might do. Easy does it. We we cause you no harm. We don't intend any anything bad here. There we go. Garnet stone. What was that prompto? Right, how do we uh do we have to go back the way we came or can we just jump off the cliff? Uh what is down that way anyway? Uh can we afford to run now? Oh fuck! Oh shit! Two wings on its head. Oh, we didn't, we didn't do anything. Don't mind us. Oh, you're just gonna fly off. My God, that is a massive wingspan. Off it goes. Phew. Epic music as well for it. Oh, 
what was basically a bird waking up. Barely? I seriously thought we were at journey's end. But that feat was fit for a king. Indeed. Indeed. Choco beans. Again, no new recipes, Ignis, really? You're letting me down, man. Uh. You were saying I've got a new recipe every two seconds when I was playing this, originally. Uh, how do we get down? Well, I suppose he's gone now, so we can just go back the way we came, but I just want to see if there's anything up here. I might have to set that music, because I do have the soundtrack on my phone now. Um, Mega Elixir, thank you. I might set that track as my alarm. Just so when I do wake up, it plays that epic music and sets me up for the day. I, I might try that. I think I will. Anyway, right, back to the car. In fact, we can just... Uh... Can we not return to the car? Why is it not letting us do that? Usually it does, doesn't it? Fine. We'll have to hoof it. Hmm. Thinking that 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 bird, that zoo, is probably going to be a hunt. Oh, nice here, indeed. So we'll take that shit back to Dino. Can we fast travel back to Golden Key, or is it going to make us actually drive there? I could return to rest point. Oh, hello! Oh, it's these guys! These were in a hunt that we were supposed to do. Let's take them out. Nice. Nice and weak against my sword, the Masamune! Should be good practice. There's a few of them. I think you can target the body or the horn, and if you attack the horn, it can break off. Nice item for it. Yeah! Yes, hard whiskers. Just gonna watch my MP. I do get carried away. I forget I'm not at the end of the game and I can just do that basically infinitely without running out. Careful, don't let him get you. you. Ouch. Oh, hello. And I'm in stasis. See? So easy to get carried away. Not too bad, though. Not too bad. So, hop in the car. If we do have to drive there, at least we'll get to listen to some more fantastic music. And you can't... Yeah, there's a shop in the car for some reason. You can buy stuff from it. I don't know how that works. Uh, quest location... Yep, it's going to make us drive there. That's fine. Everything in order? Yep. Matoya's Cave. One of, uh, that was always one of my favourite tracks from the first one. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. It's very relaxing just driving around like this, and I'm so glad they implemented soundtracks, because otherwise it might be a tad boring. I wonder if they're going to bring out more music as DLC. Do 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 I hope Dino appreciates this. We nearly got absolutely brutalized by a giant Well, I don't know what you would call it really. Having two feathers on your head, how does that work exactly? Feathers, not wings, I mean. Anyway. Let's park up in the actual parking spot this time. Nice reversing, lovely. 
I'm shit at that. <laughs> I am so Maybe shit at the reverse park. Stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? It's only a bit of banter, Prompto. Cool your beans. We'll get your knickers in a twist. We'll quickly refuel. It only costs five gil. Oh, wow. Kind of makes you wonder why they even bothered putting it in the game if it's that cheap and easy. Huh? <clears throat> Must be a pay at the pump type deal. Right, the tank is now full. Alright, Dino. We got your stone. If I remember correctly, though, he's gonna give us quite a nice reward. One well, problem is, I have to run all the way along this bloody pier. Especially when you fuck up the sprint thing. Don't know where the cat's gone. Oh no, the cat's still there. Well. Well, he should be full for a little bit. That was quite a big meal. Yeah, we're going to learn more about Luna Freya and how she's an oracle. It's it's not really explained at the moment. Of course, if you do watch the uh, King's Glaive and stuff, you learn more about her anyway. I'm sure I've mentioned that. Definitely helps you get a bigger picture. Uh, hello, Dino. We got your shit. Nice work, kid. Sorry for giving you such a hard time. I just had to get my hands on this, even if it meant blackmail. You understand, don't you? You no, see, I don't. I'm a reporter by day and an amateur jeweler by night. This elusive little beauty is going to become a masterpiece. To make it up to you, I'll share a little scoop. That special coin you got? It commemorates the Oracle's ascension. Oh. That guy was tossing them out to everyone. Must have picked them up back in Niflheim. Niflheim. And speaking of freebies, here's one from me. Come back if you want to buy more. Oh, I thanks. a souvenir like that could make its way into the hands of an ordinary citizen. Oh well, it's our pocket change now. Let's learn from history and book a place this time. Hmm. So, he was handing out those coins, was he? I wonder why. And I wonder who he is. Uh, we'll probably find out eventually. So, we got ourselves a new accessory there, and uh, I'm pretty sure at other points in the game you can go and run more errands for Dino and he'll make better accessories. So let's check that out. It was a garnet thingy. Madubri, what's it? Don't know who to give it to, though. Gladio doesn't have an accessory, does he? Um, increases strength. Well, holy crap, that will increase his strength by quite a bit. Nearly double. That's rather nice. I, I kind of want to give that to Noct, though. I think I will. I'll swap that and give him the garnet bracelet. Uh, the, the bronze bangle shit, whatever. Yeah. So now we can do a bit more uh, pain dealing. A lovely lighting. Right, well, it's about that time again to call it a night, I think. Um. Oh shit, we need to talk to Dino again. We need to ask him how to get on board. Completely forgot. As promised, I'm in the process of securing your ferry tickets right now. Told you, I'm a man of integrity. Should be smooth sailing from here. So let me know when you're ready to ship out. How does he have so much sway when it comes to this, anyway? The ship. Well, must be pretty connected if he can pull some strings around an Imperial embargo. Yeah, that guy's one artful artisan. <laughs> hmm, so we'll talk to him again. You guys ready to set sail? Um, unable to return for some time. Are you certain you wish to continue? Well, yeah, I guess that's not much else I want to do right now. We're going to have op other opportunities. Already? So, the ship fuck it. Tomorrow. How about you find a place to spend the night? It's bedtime. It's bedtime. It says that in such a creepy way. Maybe it's just me. 
Bah! We got a bah rank. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Um, yeah, actually, come to think of it, at this point, because you can rest here for free, it would have been it would have made more sense to build up more XP because you get two times bonus. So, oh well. So we get to level nine anyway. And there he is, level three. New filter memory. Some more photos. What is hey, that? This one's pretty good. No, I it know. isn't. I dig it too. No, it's shit. You can't see anything. That That's cool though. Was... Come now, it's nothing special. That's a that's a cool action shot. I like that. We're saving that one. Uh, that's pretty you. beautiful. We'll take that. Look at okay. you. Yeah, I know. Is he Why reaching for so his cock? Jack? He's reaching for his dick. Oh, that's a that's a splendid photo. All right. <laughs> Nailed cool, it. Cool, cool. Why can't I warp too? So unfair. Nothing else, right? Let's rest up. I think we got some story things gonna happen.